Hamilton County's newest addition to the department rolls into town. And now the question remains, how will it be used? It is 24 tons of reinforced steel. It's bulletproof, bomb-proof, and it could soon be rolling down any street in Hamilton County. Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Mike Dardis. Good evening to you as well. I'm Allison Montoya in for Cherie tonight. The MRAP has arrived and in a story you will only see right here on WLWT, John London explains how and when authorities plan to use it. John? Yeah, Allison, the intent is to safely transport SWAT personnel to and from a scene, but uh, the MRAP may also be used in, say, evacuations during snow emergency. It's got the capability to go where lesser vehicles cannot go. Here it is, all 48,000 pounds of it. An armored vehicle that withstood improvised explosive devices and small arms fire in Iraq and Afghanistan. It arrived here today by way of Fort Bliss. If this never comes out, I'm okay with that. Uh, but we've got it if we need it. In the roiling aftermath of rioting out of Ferguson, Missouri, the momentum for militarizing police departments has been called into question nationwide. Forest Park Chief Phil Cannon, who heads the Hamilton County Police Association, is concerned about the image this new addition presents. But after five months of paperwork and process... We just felt that uh, it was something that we needed to continue on with. The military term is MRAP, Mine Resistant Ambush Protected. It can seat 10. It will be stored at the Sheriff's Department's Road Patrol facility, available for use by SWAT. 